Hello everybody and welcome back to another week. This, this is your boy Gavin the KGS. This week we will be playing a game called Scary Hospital Horror Game. Being very informative and straight to the point. This game was developed by Next Generation Gaming who, who created the, the horror game which was released back in 2019. I've never played it so I can't say much about it. But we will be giving this game a go. So I really, like I said, all I know is it's apparently a scary horror hospital. I'm Henry working for a private newspaper company. This company sends too many reporters to investigate and get information about his haunted hospital but on one comeback from this hospital. Now I decided to get information about his haunted hospital, a few days ago I started the search in this hospital, this hospital is haunted and only Freddy was escaped from this hospital. Freddy's granny and grandpa admit him in a mental hospital for treatment but after a few days, the doctors change treatment in the national hospital. But the national hospital was closed a long time ago because people saw here ghosts and evil patients here. I'm Henry working for a private newspaper company. This company Okay, I didn't actually skip that. But how many times did I have to hear hospital? I understand this is a hospital horror game. But that was a lot of horrors, okay. I actually like the, the, the heart icon. Get some information with the What's going on in this hospital? Follow the blood spurts. What's the point of me following the blood spurts when you've actually just given me a marker? A dead body. Got a gun. Let's find something. Pick up the cutters. Unlocking the door. So how do I get my pistol? Or do I have to kind of wait until I'm actually in a match before I get to use the pistol? Because if I go to the far side, then what? Okay. I know I sound very patronizing or wrong, but you have no idea how many hospitals that there is a set. Like, doors locked. Right. Inventory. Can I, I use you? Um. That's one way of opening a door. Okay, so. Okay, can I E him? No. Find the key and unlock the door. What the heck? Oh, right, right, there's the key. Give me the big shiny key. I've already wasted one round. Okay. Oh, by the way, this game has only been released, um, like a couple of days. Oh, give me back my gun. How many rounds did you even give me? Five? Well, actually, you give me six. I wasted a round. Uh, wasn't really my fault, being honest. So, I have to find information about something. I love how I just simply walk through the door, which is closed. And, right. Can I have a can? Nope. Yeah, that's blocked off. Could still be something over here. There is an escape room mode, so the chances are try what was that what is this six um okay I still have to find the key ah. excuse me the hospital is closed so why you are here where 
will. What the hell? What happened to her? That was a woman. She had a very, very pointy chin. Dr. Down started the experiment on humans. He and the other person take the patients from the mental hospital and start an experiment on them. They want to create a different type of creatures. Unfortunately, most patients can't, aren't, can't, or can't, what? All right. Stop firing, and why is my cursor messing around? Uh, yeah. what, what's going on? Why was I going around the place? I've literally wasted my last shot. If I find anybody, I'm dead. Like, I'm not even kidding. Well, that looks ominous. Oh, oh, come on. I know that's gonna come alive. It's a typical horror game. Oh. See, it says to explore the first floor and go in. Okay, no, it's actually completely different from that one. Uh, explore the first floor and go into the second floor. Right. I think I have to go kill this person. Oh! Oh, what game? Ah! I think it was the. Sh no, it wasn't the Shadow Hatman I played. But it had the, like. Pre it all I can remember was I was able to hide in one previous games I was able to hide in these. Right, I'm gonna open these doors up. Open, thank you. Because he's gonna come up. A dead body. He had no heart in his body. Well yeah, I want that. I got a health drink. A health drink. Why did the music just ominously stop? His heart is gone. Does that mean something's going to be coming? Find a key inventory that fails. It says six, but that's not helping me. Unless, actually, no, yeah, that's one of the numbers I find. Okay. So, every sh uh, there's basically there's six sheets here. I have to be able to find six sheets. That is easier said than done. Because I have to be right in the faces of everything. Just to get them. Can I like bend down? No. So if they're under anything, that's already gonna be an issue. I know that this is an escape room type game, but Yeah. Six. Um eh. Um I know this is not the end. Hey buddy, he has no heart. Do I have anything else? I have health drink. I don't think giving him a health drink is gonna help me right now. What is that on the wall? It's a massive hand print. Looks like from a bear or something. I don't know, Bigfoot? What does this say? Literally just read that. Right. So, okay, I just realized that. That's new. Six. Yeah. The music shut off again. I 
find you. Okay, one more. Where's the last one? What did I get? Three. Um, can I drag? No, can I reload? Yes. It still says I have nothing. The only issue I have with trying to find these is that you don't really be given any form of a marker. Like, like you're meant to, but you don't. Hmm. Unless everything has the lead. Four, six, eight. What is the last one? I bet you it's in one of these two rooms. I don't see where and I don't see how. But fair enough, we did just see one of the notes barely like hanging out of one of the TVs. Well, I, what am I calling a TV? Out of one of the um, toilets. Where are you? Are you behind the sofa? No. Are you back down? Hmm. Yes, you are. Time to go back up. Okay, I can still reload, but I'm not being given my three rounds. I know there are only three rounds, but all it takes is for that to wake up and I'm dead. Or for that thing to come and get me. Right. Um. This is really buggy. Um, like, I'm not even kidding. Um, and I don't want to mark the game down because I thought I was getting somewhere, but it's been almost like literally half of a half an hour, and I can't. How does we go away? Come back. Select you. Can't go up and down. Can I put numbers in? I literally need 4681. I've only gone one right. Because I haven't been able to teach it. Um. Damn. So, I restarted the game there, and, um, yeah, I literally this time have no ammo because it took four shots to, to take down that woman, and back in the other room whenever we were trying to get the key, um, Every time that you went left or right, you kept on shooting instead. So you literally waste bullets trying to open things up. Um, you. Back in the game. Can I come in here? Nope, okay. And not every. Okay. 
I don't think everything's meant to spawn back to their original places because whenever we went back through, well, from the beginning, the toilet paper wasn't actually there. But where it is now is a different kettle of fish. And we still have to go in here. A dead body. He had no heart in his body. Oh, it was moved here. Right. That's not too bad. I do like how they were trying to be randomized. Right. I, I selected up. Um, is this already a bug? And I'm talking about a very bad bug in the game, a very bad glitch, where you cannot seem to get anywhere or do the basics in the game because of this bug. Um, oh, by the way. Hitting escape whenever you watch the cutscene does not speed it up, actually. It doesn't. That's another bug. Um, you guys can see my cursor, right? Like, I'm selecting everywhere. I'm hitting every number everywhere. I don't know why you're reloading an empty gun. I, I, I really don't know. Back away. Come back in. What did I just hit to get you back to the one? Back in. Come on. Come on. Can I... I can't even... I'm now stuck inside this. That's a very, very bad glitch. The last time I played games like this, where I couldn't get anywhere, was Mortem, being honest, it was Mortem. I was incapable of being able to continue. Like the chat like there is achievements in this game for unlocking a lot of different creatures. And we've only came across one creature and we're now stuck again. No, hey, jump, no, RT. That's not working. Get me out of here. Nope. Um. I don't really want to give a review now, but I'm forced to. And I can tell you this like I said, the last time I had given any form of a bad feedback it was because the game was not playable and I can promise you this no one wants to spend money on a game that is unplayable and like this is, I'm literally having deja vu with this game and I don't like that um, mainly because the last time the creators took almost a year just to make the game playable and I understand if you have like a working life and you know you have other things but I've, I've said this before don't commit yourself to a game when you're not actually fixing the game now I've been playing this game in total for about half an hour roughly and from the very beginning the escape doesn't work which is a very bad flaw I've never heard the word hospital so many times in my damn life <laughs> Uh, I don't mind the fact that the, the sheet that, that the sheets of paper are can be randomized, even though only one out of four of them was randomized the second time around. Um, you only get X amount of bullets, and you waste a good percentage of them just to try and move a box. 
that is about another glitch that you might need solved. I'm hoping that the bullet, the whole like um, killing animations and all that there, and the amount of bullets to kill a woman goes down to one headshot because I legit went from six rounds to nothing. And even then, it was only four rounds I planted in there, and two of them was from a box. Um, I'm now glitched inside this, and I can't seem to uh, enter my code for a second time. And, like I said, I'm just, I am very disappointed. Um, like, at the same time, I don't like, no, 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 at the same time, I do like how within your budget you have been trying to, you know, make everything seem not realistic, but, you know, of good resolution and good textures, uh, but you might need a clang up and everything a little bit. Um, and you might have to, like, I personally am going to say, maybe fix your audio. Um, especially when speaking, because there is a part whenever that woman stands up and you immediately jump from one line to the next line and then instead of walking around she just teleports to you or teleports teleports? Um, I'm, I'm going to be fair, like I've been fair with all the games I've ever played I will, play, I will literally give this game a go again, if you fix all those problems uh, most importantly, the one that I'm stuck inside right now, because I was really hoping to continue on this game, but overall, I'm going to have to give this game, I'm going to give this game 2 out of 10. One of those points is because I don't mind the textures, like I have played Shadow Hatman, and its graphics aren't any better than this one. But the extra point was only given out of sympathy. Um, so please, and I mean please, if you can get this game fixed and um, next generation gaming, if you can get this fixed within the week, I promise I will play this game again next week. If you do not, I'm sorry, I, I will l literally just give it a bad review. Um, you know, similar to uh, Mortem, and similar to like a bunch of other games I've played, um, the Archer included, uh, I will give this game a second go. I will replay the game, and if you have fixed these problems, I will at least give you a positive review. Um, I'm saying M a lot, like, I don't know why, but I've got a lot of saliva build up in my mouth. So, yeah. Until I see results and until I see an update, I cannot recommend this game. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I am dreadfully sorry that I've had to end the episode here. Um, but like I said, give the game creators hope. And I can tell you this. If they actually sit down and work on this game, like, I'm not even going to lie, like, the game's only been out for about two or three days, but, you, you know, don't release a game that is basically broken until you fix the game. Common sense. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this uh, walkthrough was some form of help to you. And I'll see you hopefully next week playing this game. Goodbye!